Tonight, we begin with a young man's courageous battle and the team of support surrounding him. 14-year-old Devin Wooten from Clinton is fighting brain cancer for the third time. Today at Arkansas Children's Hospital, he had some special visitors to brighten his day. And THV 11's Caitlin Gardenhire brings us the story. Holy Father, we come to you today thanking you for all the many blessings of life that you shower upon us each and every day, Lord. We thank you for the blessing of brotherhood, and we thank you for the blessing of us getting to extend our brotherhood to Devin Wooten, Lord. We uh, want him to know that he's always a part of the Harding Boston football family. Devin Wooten is a warrior. He started battling brain cancer when he was five years old. Devin's story starts in 2008, November the 14th when he was diagnosed with a uh, pendymoma, grade two brain tumor. A few years down the road, his battle continued. In 2015, they removed a meningioma from behind his right eye. By the time he was 14, he had overcome two types of brain cancer. But despite numerous treatments, he was diagnosed with a third type of brain cancer this year, glioblastoma cancer. He doesn't complain. He doesn't say, Mom, I wish this didn't happen to me. And he takes it one day at a time and says, I'll just keep fighting and I'll just keep going. And he's been a testimony to so many people. Devin's story has reached thousands of people on social media. And the Harding football team wanted him to know how much he inspired them. So they paid him a surprise visit Friday night. No matter what happens to you, you're always going past your circumstances. It doesn't matter. And so I feel like you embody the spirit of a warrior. So that really speaks to all of us who are trying to be warriors in our own lives. They traded stories, laughed, and prayed. Devin says he hopes his strength gives others going through hard times hope. As for him, he says there's no need to be down because he's battled brain cancer twice before and he'll battle and overcome it again. And I'll just say I am a brain cancer survivor. Yep. Yeah. In Little Rock, Caitlin Gardenhire, THV 11 News. The Clinton High School football team and the Wonderview girls basketball team also paid Devin a visit. If you would like to donate or keep up with Devin's story, we have a link to his website and GoFundMe on our website.